What's up, my Lukey League, and we're back on Pokemon Black 2 for episode number 23 of our Let's Play Pokemon Black 2 series. In the last episode, we made our way through Route 23, Victory Road, and beat the first Elite Four member, Grimsley. And in this episode, we're going to go ahead and take on another Elite Four member. Before we start, if you guys want to hit that like button down below, since we are coming to a ending, let's end it out with a bang. So hit that like button down below. Really helps out the channel, really helps out me as a person, and really keeps me motivated. Also, do not forget to answer the question today in the comments section below. Though. So, uh, let's get with a quick team recap. Am I right? Let's do a quick team recap. We have level 52 Brohawk with high jump kick, crunch, strength, and a brick break with the wide lens. Then we have Spall Keisha the Ampharos with power jam, a signal beam, thunder wave, thunderbolt. Taught him thunderbolt in the last episode. And we have Oakley the Flygon with fly, rock slide, a dragon tail, and bulldoze with expert belt. We have Arvac the Arcanine with flamethrower, will o wisp, extreme speed, and thunder fang holding the charcoal. Then we have Buddy the Roserade with Giga Drain, Leech Seed, Vanish Shock, and Shadow Ball holding the powerful Big Root. Works really well with Giga Drain and Leech Seed. And last but not least, we have Riptide the Samurai with Waterfall, Ice Beam, Surf, Mega Horn holding these Scope Limbs to boost that crit hit, critical hit ratio. So that is what we're looking at right now. And actually, I'm going to go ahead and give some rare candies because, I don't know, I feel like that could be a little useful. So we have three rare candies, to my knowledge. Yes. All right. So who is lacking a little bit? Who... So who do we want to battle next? I think I want to battle the Psychic one. So I'm going to go ahead and give one to you. Give one to you. And I'm just going to give one to Buddy to keep him a little level up. So that works. That is good. So we're good. So let's go ahead and do the Psychic Jasmine. No, your name isn't Jasmine. No, who, who, who is it? Who is it? It's not Jasmine. Whoa, what the heck? This is so freaking cool. I don't remember any of these things. But here we are, guys. Whew, second Elite Four member. All right, so we're leading off with Brohawk. I feel confident with that. So let's go ahead and beat her. It's me who appeared when the flower opened up. You standing over there. You look like a Pokemon trainer with strength and kindness. What I look for in my opponent is superb strength. I'm counting on you. Whew, all right, guys. So let's go ahead and battle the second Elite Four member, Caitlyn. That's her name. All right. She's got a Musharna. Now that I think about it, I probably should have put the expert belt on Brohawk. But oh well. So let's go for Crunch. Hopefully this will do half. All right. That's perfect. Charge Beam misses. That is the way I want to start off this battle. Awesome. So let's go for another Crunch here. Hopefully this will finish it off. Maybe we get min damage. Awesome. So Musharna is down. And the reason I gave one to Ampharos is because I uh, created Candy to Ampharos is because she has a Sigilyph, so want to get that out of there. So she has a Renew Class. This thing does have Focus Blast, but I don't really have another choice. I kind of have to stay in and hope that she misses it. So let's do it. I mean, I think she has Focus Blast. I honestly cannot 100% guarantee that. But why would she bring it in? And yes, she does have Focus Blast. So hopefully we can eat up this Focus Blast. My special defense is pretty good. It's pretty solid. Come on, come on. Oh, we ate that up like a champ. Not bad. Go for that crunch. Finish off the reunique. Reuniqueless. That is awesome. I think Brohawk is just gonna clean up, sweep this team. Unless Sigilyph. Well, Sigilyph. When Sigilyph comes out, Sigilyph. I just said like Sigilyph three times in the same sentence. What the heck? All right. So let's go to Sparkisha. Hopefully, Sparkisha will be able to clean this up. Really hoping that. I don't see why not. I really don't. So let's go ahead and go for a Thunderbolt that we actually got in the last episode. I think I already talked about that. In these Elite Four episodes, I know they're going to be insanely short, so that just means you guys can watch the whole thing. <laughs> Alright. Oh, that killed. That's awesome. Alright. So that just did a lot. Holy crap. Alright, so now it's Gothitel. Gothitel, Gothitel. Uh, Riptide. I'm not going to go to Brohawk because it's way too low. Let's see if we can get through this without using one healing item. That, that would be... That is my goal. All right, Gothitelle. Do you have Shadow Tag? I really hope. Oh, he has Frisk, not Shadow Tag. Okay. I can't believe it's come to this. Let's go for that Mega Horn. Oh, crap, Calm Minds. Okay. Well, that is not exactly my cup of tea. But hopefully, Mega Horn does not miss, and it won't. Maybe it'll do under half. Okay. Let's do it for a Waterfall this time. Oh, you have Thunderbolt. Welp. All right. That, it was good knowing you, Riptide. Yeah, there's no way you're living that. I'm sorry. Didn't mean for this to happen. 
Oakley, I don't know. I don't really know who else to go out into. All of my Pokemon are really freaking frail. Like, that is th that is annoying. But I'm pretty sure we're faster than her. Oh, I'm gonna go for a Bulldoze. Because this will lower her speed. And uh, that means that I can come in with, uh, what's his face? Oh, you're going for another Calm Mind. Oh, that is not exactly what I want. That's not what I want. Not what I want, and not what I need. Alright, damage. Psychic, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, buddy. It's okay. Hold on. Oh, oh well. Oh, well. <laughs> it's okay. Alright, so now I believe we can go into Brohawk and crunch this thing for the win. Oh, that's it. Alright, let's go for a crunch. Come on, let's finish it off. Let's finish it off right here. Not even bad. So Gothitelle goes down. And I believe we're going to go to level 54. And there we go, guys. We just beat the second Elite Four member, Caitlyn. Not bad. You haven't faced all of the members of the Elite Four yet, have you? Don't concern yourself about me. Go on ahead. Alrighty, alrighty. So, Caitlyn goes down. So that is the second Elite Four member. Let's go ahead and save it up. Save the game. I'm not save the game. Let's go ahead and put on some revives and stuff. We're not saving yet. Two Pokemon died. So I just realized the next Elite Four member, Scrafty, is going to be pretty much carrying the team too. I mean, I guess Buddy can too. Buddy can really actually carry the team. He's got Shadow Ball. So we will definitely see. We'll definitely see. I'll probably end up leading with Buddy. Just to give us uh, some diversity. I honestly do not see why not. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's put Buddy up front for a second. And guys, we beat the second gym leader. So gym leader, hello. E elite four members. So that is actually going to be it for episode number 23. I, I can't even register that. Moment. This is freaking awesome. So episode number 23 of our Let's Play Pokemon Black 2 series. We beat the second gym leader. And second gym leader again in Elite Four in this episode. So make sure you guys hit that like button down below. If you guys are hyped, it also shows a lot of support. We almost have the champion battle coming on. So let's go ahead and end the series off with a bang with a bunch of likes. That would be freaking, 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 freaking awesome. Also, make sure you guys answer the question of the day in the comment section down below. Because that would be freaking awesome. So thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you stay tuned for the uh, third Elite Four member. Because that will be tomorrow's episode. And I will see you guys then. Peace out.